I might as well take this money and throw it in the bin because I can't use it in Ecuador. Let's go, baby. Woo! In today's video, we're going to talk about a subject that everyone likes to talk about. We're going to talk about money. Specifically, we're going to talk about British money. In Britain, our currency is called the pound, or locally, we call it sterling. There's two different variations of the pound that's used in Britain. There's the pound that's printed in Scotland, and there's the pound that's printed in England. They're both exactly the same currency, but they're just printed in different parts of the country. Occasionally, there can be problems using the Scottish version of the money down in England. For example, if I took this £20 Scottish note down to England and I tried to buy something from a shop, they might say they cannot accept it, but if you explain to them, if you debate with them, eventually they will take your money. When I go travelling to another country, I like to take hard cash with me. So when I arrive in my final location, I have money in hand that I can exchange for the local currency. Before I departed for Ecuador, I went to a local cash machine in Scotland and I took out £300. So I had £300 in Scottish pounds. Then I went down to Liverpool in England to see my family and to say goodbye to them. And I decided I needed more money. So I went to a local cash machine and I took out 500 pounds. And I was given English sterling pounds. So I had 300 pounds of Scottish money and 500 pounds of English money. After I arrived in Ecuador, my first priority was to exchange my money from pound sterling into the local currency, which is dollar. Whilst in Quito Airport, I found a local currency exchange counter and I went up to change my money from pound sterling into dollar. I gave all my money to the lady at the exchange counter. She began to separate the notes, looking at them one at a time, and she put them into two separate piles. One pile was the English pound notes, the second pile was the Scottish pound notes. Upon separating the money into two separate piles, she took the pile of Scottish money, she slid it towards me, and she said she could not accept the currency. I asked her why not. She said, this is not official currency. And I explained to her, this is British money. It was printed in Scotland, but it can be used all over Britain. The lady replied by saying, they do not accept Scottish printed money in Ecuador. Since being in Ecuador, I've went to several banks and tried to change my Scottish money and they all say the same thing. They do not accept this money. My advice to anyone who's coming from Britain to Ecuador, please ensure that you do not take Scottish pound notes. They do not accept them. Make sure that you take the English version of the pound note or exchange your money in Britain to dollar and arrive with the dollar so you don't have the same problems that I did. So there you have it. My lack of research has bit me in the butt. I've got 300 pounds of Scottish money and I can't use it until I leave Ecuador. 